Without objection, the gentlelady is recognized for one minute. Mr. Speaker, the American flag on our nation's capital is flying at half mast to honor the life of American hero, Ohio Senator and Colonel John Herschel Glenn, being laid to rest today at Arlington Cemetery. What a human being. What a patriot. What an American hero. And what a Marine whose raw courage was evidenced time and time again devoted, faithful husband to his beautiful wife Annie and father and grandfather. His life and works keep giving to us and our world. John was a highly decorated war veteran, Marine Corps colonel who completed 56 combat missions on the Pacific Front alone during World War II and then served in the Korean conflict. He was awarded six distinguished flying crosses and 18 clusters on his Air Medal. At the dawn of the Space Age, Senator Glenn became the first human being to orbit our planet Earth in 1962 on Friendship 7. Can you imagine his awe as he became the first human to observe planet Earth suspended aloft in the heavens with endless space beyond? In 1974, John Glenn was elected to the U.S. Senate and undertook many tough missions in his life, but none could have been more piercing than when he was given the weighty task of informing the children of Senator Robert F. Kennedy of that senator's fateful assassination. John Glenn's life embodies the words devotion, honor, patriotism, and bravery. He never stopped giving. At age 77, he chose to join the team of astronauts who were launched into space on the Discovery. And upon retirement from the U.S. Senate in 1999, after a quarter century of service, he dedicated his years to founding and raising funds for the John Glenn College of Public Affairs at The Ohio State University. In recognition of his incredible and generous life, I wish to place on our record the remarks of Vice President Joe Biden at a remembrance ceremony held in Columbus, Ohio recently, as our state honored his life and legacy. May the angels lead John Glenn into paradise and give peace to his family. May eternal rest grant unto you, dearest Senator and Colonel Glenn, you gave all that you could possibly give, and America is forever grateful. May I ask my colleagues to stand with me for a moment of silence in remembrance of Senator John Glenn. Thank you.